Hello, snowboarders of the internet. I'm your host, Avrin Lefebvre, and this is Explain, the show where we break down the tech in the gear you use to go snowboarding. In today's episode, we're going to be talking about mini discs. What are they? How do they work? And do you need them? The name mini disc should imply exactly what it is it's a miniature disc. This is a regular size, this is a mini. One of the big things we always talk about with bindings and boards is the flex and the feel underfoot. Mini discs reduce that dead spot underfoot. They allow for better movement and transition of power right there because the dead spot and where it's inserted onto the board and just screwed down is so much smaller. I mean, obviously it's gonna be smaller. When you put one in front of the other, you see how small they are. The concept of the mini disc is to reduce the footprint and dead spot underfoot in your binding. Obviously something with a bigger disc is gonna have a bigger dead spot than something with a mini disc. So you can see that disc is smaller. The big thing with mini discs is how it's gonna affect the binding flex on top of that board. That smaller disc is gonna allow more lateral play on the binding than that larger disc. You're gonna notice right away that you don't have that bigger dead spot with a mini disc. That's gonna allow the binding to have more of a natural flex and movement from the boot. Now, I'm not saying that full size discs are bad, I'm just saying it's a different feel. And really what it is is to minimize that dead spot underfoot. Do you need a mini disc? No, not really, but if you like more board feel and you want a lessened dead spot, then yes, you do need it. But if you're old school like me and you don't really care about having a lot of flex underfoot because you're so used to just having movement not be there, then yeah, a regular disc will work. It's not a bad thing, it's just an alternative thing. It's kind of like camber profiles. There's a lot of them out there. Some of them don't work for you with the way you ride. One of the things you need to know about mini discs is if you have slam back inserts, that set back four pack that just sits further back, they're not gonna match up that well. You're gonna end up using two screws instead of four. This has been explained and I have been your host, Avrin Lefebvre. Did you learn what a mini disc is? Good, because if you didn't, there's no hope for you. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what binding you're using. If you're new here, remember to subscribe, click the bell, get those notifications. That way you're not missing any of the videos we've got coming out for you snowboarders of the internet. And if you really want to support us and you want to see us just grow out the network that we're working on over here, swing on over to Angry Snowboarder VIP. I could tell you more here, but I've got a whole video over there that explains it so much better. Mm -hmm.